My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We got a pretty hot Mustang right here. It's a 1966 Mustang convertible. It's got a little Shelby inspiration going on with the wheels and the stripes and the scoop. 529 miles on a complete rotisserie restoration. Every nut and bolt has been a part on this car. It's restored from the bottom up. You can go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the specs, study all the pictures. That's where you find the prices on all of the collector cars that we offer for sale at volocars.com. So right now the top is down on this Mustang. Let's go for a spin. I bought it directly from the gentleman that restored it himself. Uh, he's owned the car 14 years. I bought it out of North Carolina. Uh, it's got 529 miles on the odometer that was replaced when he restored the car. Uh, so it was literally on a rotisserie, flipped on its side. The whole bottom of the car is restored, all the metals restored. So the frame rails, torque boxes, floors, all solid clean metal painted like a satin black. The complete chassis is restored. The front end is all new and detailed. All the control arms, bushings, ball joints, has a new sway bar, it's all new. New rear leaf springs, has lowering blocks, drops it down probably about an inch or so. New shocks, new bushings. New dual exhaust system that comes right out through the valence here. All new fuel system, the tank, sending unit, fuel lines. All new brakes, completely rebuilt. Uh, has disc conversion in front, new brake lines, hoses. You look up at the motor, it's all clean, painted Ford blue, it's all fresh, starters rebuilt, has a top loader four-speed transmission that's rebuilt. Uh, the U-joints are replaced, uh, the rear end is restored. I don't know the ratio offhand, I did drive this car, it's just a nice cruising gear. So underneath the car is practically new. The body is incredible. I replaced a lot of the metal. There's zero rust, zero damage in this car. It's all metal. And he did an excellent job. The gaps are really precise. Everything fits beautifully. And it is laser beam straight. I know it's a white car. White can hide a lot. This thing could be black and it's still going to be a mirror. It is absolutely laser straight, smooth, straight, clean panels. He did not put the emblems on, so he has a nice clean look. Doesn't does say Ford on the hood, but doesn't have the emblems on the sides. All of the trim is new. The bumpers, the entire grill is new. Uh, all the stainless trim is new and shiny around the windshield, the vent window frames, door handles, the trim around the top opening, tail lights, gas cap, reverse lights, the trunk lock, all that's been replaced, all the trim. Uh, the stripes are a blue metallic, painted on smooth to the touch. They're called over-the-top stripes. Uh, again, Shelby inspired. Inside the trunk is all clean, fresh metal, painted white, glossy. Uh, new trunk mat, new well liner. The tail light housings are new. New wiring harness, new weather strip. So it's an immaculate trunk compartment. Convertible top is white. It's a power top. It's brand new. Top frame is painted. The weather strips are new. Uh, it's got a really nice fitting boot, too. The wheels are 17-inch Craggers. They do look similar to the 65 Shelby-style wheels. They're a modern version of it, I should say. They have new performance tires. Uh, the windshield's replaced. It has a scoop on the hood. Let's see what's under the hood. He said it's the original 289 motor and it's completely rebuilt with a little more performance. Uh, it's board 30 over, has a hotter cam. On top it's got an Edelbrock intake with a Holly carb, has some ceramic coated headers. The engine itself is painted real nice and neat, dressed up with some Mustang finned aluminum valve covers. Got the open element uh, chrome air cleaner like a Shelby would have. 
and all the components, all the nuts and bolts and master cylinder and wiring and fuel pump and oil sending unit and alternator, pulleys, they all look new. Upgraded with an aluminum, polished aluminum radiator, it's oversized, it's got a new shroud, new fan, new battery cables, has a disconnect on the battery. The interior is all new. Down on the floor is new carpet. It's got that Hearst shifter sticking out of the hump in the floor. All new upholstery. Uh, the trim, the stainless trim or aluminum trim on the seats are new. The side panels are new. The handles and cranks, the door panels, all that's new. Metals repainted. New dash pad, new instrument uh, bezels, new knobs. The original AM radio is in place, but there's a nice modern stereo in the glove box with Bluetooth. Uh, it has speakers in the kick panels and these side panels, four matching round speakers. The visors are new, has a walnut steering wheel. So while we started up, I did drive this car home. It handles great. Uh, also wanted to mention, of course, the door jams are all repainted and new sill plates, all new weather strips. But it was fun shifting through the gears, top down. Oh yeah, you can hear it's got a little bit of a cam. I like how that sounds. Little cold blood, it got warm up in just a minute. That sounds like popcorn popping. There's a little firecracker and the paint works outstanding even up here by the hinges it's just crisp and clean and did a really really nice job on the fit and finishes on this car so it's a sporty car good looking car quality is there that's my impression of this one here visit volocars.com plenty of ways to contact the salesman they'd be happy to answer your questions or concerns uh, they can help get it delivered anywhere in the country they can help you get financing. That's at volocars.com.